Talladega. Let's talk about the rainfall. That's the big story. And that rain is beginning to inch closer and closer to Alabama. We're seeing a patch of rain from Jackson all the way down to New Orleans. I would call this round one. And then round two is going to be the heavier rain that's west of the Mississippi River at this time. So how does that translate into our rain timeline? Well, the rain starts tomorrow morning intermittently, but it comes. Uh, it's going to be basically on and off throughout the day tomorrow. Heaviest rainfall that will be in the afternoon and evening, and that rain will continue through the early hours on your Friday morning. But that rain should clear out of here just around daybreak on Friday, leaving the rest of your Friday morning and afternoon rain free. So let's talk about the map for a second because we'll add in the rain and the temperatures here. So through the early morning hours, it stays relatively quiet. Temperatures again kind of holding in the upper 30s to low 40s. We will see an occasional shower or two early morning. It shouldn't be very disruptive. Could leave a few spots on the roadways a little damp. So just plan for that. May need to tack on a little extra time in the morning. And then we're looking at some rainfall at around 6 a.m. in East Alabama. We'll get a decent break until about 9 to 10 a.m. And that's when we'll start to see more widespread rain. That will continue to lift from the west to the northeast through the afternoon. Heaviest pockets of rain will arrive tomorrow after lunchtime, though. So we'll have intermittent light showers before noon, and then we'll have heavier rain later in the day. 4 p.m. tomorrow. Temperatures in the low to mid 40s, heavy pockets of rain in and around central Alabama. By 8 p.m., we'll begin to see a clearing sky to our west, and by 11 o'clock, those scattered showers uh, will become, I would say, a little bit more broken up as the heaviest rain begins to enter into Georgia from 11 p.m. Thursday night into the early mornings on uh, morning hours on Friday. By 2 to 3 a.m., we're just left with a couple of isolated showers. By 8 o'clock on Friday, you're waking up, getting out the door. The rain will be completely gone. We'll actually begin to see some peaks of sunshine for your Friday, and notice temperatures Friday afternoon will be in the lower 50s. So we'll get a little break from this cold air that we started the week with. Temperatures will trend a bit more seasonable. There's that sunshine this weekend. Temperatures both Saturday and Sunday in the low to mid 50s. Hey, and that sunshine sticks around through early next week. And that's a look at your